Welcome to another video from Dr. Locke. How do you identify a screen door cylinder? Well, there's a couple of different screen door cylinders uh, we've got here. Now, they can all look the same, but the one thing about screen door lock cylinders is that they have a floating cam in the middle, which means this middle section here can move like this. Okay. Other cylinders that look the same, and they do look identical, may not be a screen door cylinder or suitable for a screen door cylinder or security screen. This is one here. This one here, the middle drive, does not move. It moves a little bit, but it does not move. That's suitable for a European mortise lock or other locks that use a fixed cam. These screen door cylinders here, which have that moving middle section, are what we call a floating cam. So that's a floating cam. You can use that on a sliding screen door, you can use that on a hinge screen door. And these two here generally come in about, uh, well there's actually three sizes, but generally speaking you'll only probably see two. This is a five pin version, which means it uses five pins. And this takes the standard Lockwood key here. So if you wish to have your screen doors match to uh, your deadlocks or your Lockwood deadlocks, you can do that. If you purchase from us, we can actually match your order. So if you order a deadbolt and you want your screen doors to match, we can do that. Generally, we'll be using a five pin cylinder to do that. There are variations of this cylinder that come in even six pin, but they are more, uh, quite rare and generally not used as much, but we do have them. So if it says five pin, it's a standard one. If it's six pin, it's a longer one. The other variation of this um, is the screen door using discs. Uh, this is a smaller cylinder here. They use discs to uh, shape the key and they give you a little bit less security. They're not as strong as the pin pin security ones. So these ones here that are using pins, if you want to put a good cylinder on your screen door, use the one that has pins. It's stronger. It's stronger and uh, will give you more resistance against attack. These screen door, these small screen door ones, they use discs and they can they can be opened and uh, manipulated a little bit easier. So always a good upgrade just to get a, a pin one. Okay, now the other big factor when identifying that you need a screen door cylinder and what to go for is the length. Now if you look at these two cylinders here, you're going to say that this one is longer than this one and the six pin one is even just slightly longer as well. Now when you do when you do want to order the cylinders, make sure that you have enough room for your doors to slide past each other. So if you put, if you take out this cylinder here which is in size 45 mil and you put this one here in size which is 60 mil, that extra that extra hangout of the lock might actually hit your second door. So very common the doors are very close to each other and that extra couple of millimeters you might not have that in clearance. So just make sure that you do. You can measure from the center hole out. Um, you can also measure your cylinder and add a few millimeters to say well whether or not the other door is going to hit the, hit the other door or not. So those are the sliding or hinged screen door security lock cylinders or fly screen cylinders. There is one more which we don't have here to show you, and that's for the Austral Ultimate. The Austral Ultimate screen door lock has a little tiny spring in here. These ones don't, and that little tiny spring is unique to Austral Ultimate locks, screen door locks. So if you've got a Witco, um, a Carbine, uh, a standard lock, uh, Austral Elegance, uh, a Lockwood screen door, these cylinders will be fine for you. So all you need to work out is if you've got enough room to upgrade it to a pin one, which most of the time you do, and the doors can pass each other. The next option you might want to work out is if you've got five of these around your property, do you want them all to be on the same key, which is more convenient for a lot of people, and that's called key alike. So on your options there, you can select make all my cylinders the same key, and what we do is we get them from a bunch and then we, we send them out to you. If you want them all different, that's quite easily done too. You can order different, costs no extra. If you would like your key cylinders matched to your other locks in your shopping cart, we can most of the time do that as long as they're compatible. So you can order a deadbolt, uh, five screen door locks, uh, have them all operating on the same key. We set them out, you install them, and everybody's happy. For any questions, please email, and thanks for watching.